Direct variation, which is also known as direct proportion, is a linear relationship between two variables. So I'm going to underline that this, this, this first paragraph that I'm going to read out, it's going to sound quite confusing. I'm going to do my best to explain it. Now, these two variables occur in real life, and we're going to talk about a real life situation soon. And we see this whenever we multiply, we multiply one variable by a constant in order to calculate the other variable. Okay, this is the key here, and, and I'm going to illustrate this below. When I buy fruit at the supermarket, there is what's called a constant, and the constant is the cost of fruit. For example, let's say the fruit is $2 per kilo. It is constant because it doesn't change from person to person. Everyone who goes into the supermarket on this day pays $2 per kilo. It is therefore constant because it does not change. The price of the fruit does not change. There are two variables, though, that do change from person to person. And the variables that change are this. First of all, oh, sorry, second of all, actually, well, the price we pay for the fruit, and first of all, the amount of kilograms that we buy. I should have put this in a different order. Because when you go into the supermarket, you might buy, everyone buys a different amount. So you might go in and go, all right, I'm going to get three kilograms of fruit. This is the amount of kilograms that you get, one of the variables, because it changes from person to person. And then because you get three kilograms of fruit at $2 a kilo, you're going to pay $6. This is your cost. Okay. Now your cost and the amount of kilograms you buy will be different when the next person comes along. They might get four kilograms at, eight, at an $8 cost. So these are called variables because they change whereas the $2 per kilo is constant. All right, now, last of all, each person calculates the cost of fruit by multiplying the amount of kilograms, multiplying the amount of kilograms by $2. So they multiply it by $2, which essentially means to multiply one of the variables, the amount of kilograms, by the constant, and when you multiply this, you're going to get the cost of the fruit. You're going to get the other variable. And that's what it's saying here. Multiply one variable by a constant in order to calculate the other variable. Okay? And whenever you do this in real life, it is called direct variation.